So these are unusual times. It's, uh, you know, it's a, it's a crazy time for everybody. It's very stressful, mm -hmm. but there's often good things that come out of difficult times. Yeah, absolutely. I think as a community, we've certainly all learned how to pivot the word of the season. You know, we've taken hundreds of people and have made last minute changes all the way up until the very time show starts. And everybody has been so great and flexible from the talent backstage to the people sitting in the chairs watching. But the other interesting thing is we haven't gotten together as a fashion community since March. Mm -hmm. It's been almost six months. Right. We have never been apart for that long. And when we think about gathering, uh, because of the pandemic, we've had to get together online. We've spent a lot of time meeting with everybody in the community through Zoom. Mm -hmm. And you know, you might think, oh gosh, like there's there's a disconnect there and it's it's not the same. And granted, it's not the same as being right. in person. Yeah. But the great thing about it for me has been I've gotten to see people's faces up close. I've been able to get to see them in their home environments. And through that, I just feel like I've developed a deeper connection to them. I understand and know people in a way I didn't before. Right. And not just one or two people, but yeah. hundreds of people mm -hmm. I know in that way now. And that has been such a cool thing. And I really feel like it has taught us that this idea of being together, which I think is written into our DNA as people, uh, is about more than just the space that we share. Mm -hmm. It is truly about that connection and seeing each other as, as individuals, like truly seeing each other that way. It's a huge time for fostering that togetherness and that flexibility and understanding and caring mm -hmm. of each other. Absolutely. Yeah, just that sense of love. I think at the end of the day, everything we're doing is is being done out of love. And I, I would say that for anybody who's volunteering or participating, it's very much for the love of our community. So being able to, um, shoot, I'm feeling teary. <laughs> 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 being able to, um, get it together, Brooke. Just, just share that and... Um, and be tolerant and, of each and other. be tolerant, be yeah. loving and understanding. The, the love that I think people share in this community is, is unmatched. Yeah. And so I hope that as we move forward, because eventually we're gonna be out of this pandemic, it, it will end, um, let's all hold on to that idea of, of connection versus just being together. Mm -hmm. Let's hold on to that idea of, of love and tolerance uh, because I think in the end it's gonna that's that's what we have that's all we've got thank you all so much for your support this season thank you for sticking with us and for opening your minds to experiencing fashion here in Omaha in a brand new way we're very excited to share this with you and when it's all over on Saturday night please do keep in mind that you can continue to follow us on Facebook and Instagram and YouTube to keep up to date on everything new and exciting that is happening within our design community. We'll see you alongside the runway. Stay safe, be stylish in your masks, and thank you again.